First of all, as I said, the coach you know uh, after the game, and we needed these two points more than he did, uh, especially of the way we played last night. And got to come back, and they got there too by coming back from a three goal deficit. We, we couldn't do it, so it was nice for us to get that done tonight. Uh, in general, I thought I thought we played a pretty solid game. You know, sat with Kieran Milan, he played a great night, had a great night, I made some big saves, but really kept things cool, calm, and collected. There was a lot of Bouncing pucks around in front of the net. He didn't get rattled and seemed to do a real good job. Uh, I think we, we got over The only time we really lost our poise was late in the second period. I thought, but it was funny, after we scored to make it 2-1, uh, then they came out as pretty good. Uh, I guess that's 12.30. 12.43 is that when we scored, so maybe the last eight minutes of that period, I thought they really they really dominated there. We seemed to lose our boys and bounce the puck around and couldn't complete the pass. Uh, we get that back in, in control in the third period and did a pretty good job. We uh, thought all our defense had played well in a tough building to play well in. And, uh, we've had success in this building when it was the bigger rink. Uh, it was nice to get a win, a win here after they, uh, after they changed the, the configuration a little bit. So. So I think we'll, I think still think we're the uh, best team in Hockey East against UNH and Winnemore Center. And that's nice to have that going for us. More than anything else, we needed two points and we got them. We needed two points against a real solid team, a team that's a national championship contender and a, and a Hockey East championship contender, a home ice advantage team for sure. So it was nice to get on the road against that type of team. Coach, you obviously got off to a better start tonight. Uh, can you just talk about First period and being able to come out of it, not being behind three nothing. That's what I said. To the I said, hey, look, we didn't score, but we're not losing three nothing tonight. That's a that's a good start for us. Uh, I thought that was our best period as far as overall control of the game. Um, I thought we were we were pretty sharp. We outshot in that period. We had some good opportunities, and uh, in general, not giving up a bunch in the first was nice for us. Not giving up more than one to go down. We, we go down. One nothing, and then we come back and get two. So all that bodes well. The general comment is, uh, you know, it's disappointing uh, losing the game because I thought it's the best that we've played since we've been back second half. Uh, you know, it's back and forth game, and we had our chances. It was a tough uh, turnover on our part on the on the winning goal, um, but we had our chances, and you know, they, they they played tough in front of the net. Milan made some saves, and hey, it was a good hockey game. So. It's disappointing the way that we lost it on, on the, uh, the goal, the way it all happened. Do you think Malone was the difference to tonight? Well, I don't know if he was the difference, but he played well. Matt played well. I mean, it's, you know, you're talking about a two-to-one game, and the, and the winning goal was, uh, you know, a bad play on our part that got through. But uh, you know, he made some key saves. Hey, can you get a good look at that uh, little flick shot that Thompson put at Milan? It looked like a win-in. Yeah, we can't tell you. Know, I, I knew what Paul was doing, obviously, when he shot it, you know, trying to go off the back of him. So and whether it was in or not, they didn't see it on the video. So they can't see it on the video. They can't call it a goal. We did get a power play goal tonight, but were you happier with the penalty kill for coming off of last night? Yeah, I mean, we gave one up. Right. Uh, but we did a much better job. They moved it on. You know, we got one, they got one. It's, uh, they moved it well. You know, we moved it well. We had a chance on the power play at the end of Get it tied up, we couldn't get it done. Coach, the last two times you've lost here in a regular season hockey East game, the other time it was against BU as well. What do they do so well here? Well, well number one, they're a good hockey program now, which I've been, and, you know, they do, they're a talented team. And, you know, we've uh, had their number down there, and they seem to have ours uh, here. So they won the, the rubber, rubber match this year. But they, they do a lot of things well. Jack said that there was a little bit more desperation because he said he told you that they need the points more than you do. Yeah, he told me at the game, but I would disagree with him. I said he can use it too. But hey, uh, we got a, you know, 12 more games to go. It's a long way to go. We just keep battling. But I told my team the disappointing part is it's as well as we played the second half. Uh, and we won some games the second half, but we didn't play as hard as we played. I know it was behind my line, and what would you saw out of it? Uh, the one that they call back. Yeah, they didn't get. Uh, I was just I took it wide and just tried to throw it on net and kind of saw that. But uh, 
had a chance to bank off them, and uh, from what I saw, it, it was in. But uh, they called it no goal, so it's something we had to battle back from. And uh, I think we played really well tonight as a team, and our overall 60-minute effort I think was really well. Um, didn't bear down on our chances, and we didn't finish, so that was the story. But we just lost to a very good team, and uh, we still have some games in hand. So. Uh, you're not going to win them all, but I think for our effort anyway tonight was awesome. Probably the best it's been since break. So that being said, you can take things from this game and bring it on into next game. Uh, I think so. I think it's a little a little frustrating uh, just the way we lost there. and just uh, Their goalie played awesome. Milan played very well. But uh, I think the way we played tonight was, like I said, the best that we played since before break. Um, I think our overall effort all over the ice was great uh, for 60 minutes. I think we put a pretty good game together, and usually when that happens, you don't you come out on top. But uh, unfortunately, not tonight. It's, it's the only goal or the exposed goal. So nobody had a clear view of it. Did you think you had a pretty clear view of it? Thought it went? Uh, yeah, I'm, I'm pretty sure it did. But uh, I guess the refs said he didn't see it. So whatever he calls on the ice, he has to go yeah. with if it's not conclusive. But uh, it yeah, be quite I, a bit of debate about it. You know, yeah, the it's, the yeah, it took a while, but. Um, yeah, there's obviously nothing we can do about it. So, did you see it in, or did you think it was in? Uh, if it wasn't in, then you my eyes checked. But <laughs> <laughs> it's all right. It, it, I mean, it's it's just this, the game. Uh, the video is not always perfect, and if it was in, it was in by which it, it was in by an inch or so, uh, and then probably came right back out. So there's nothing you can do. And now, so you get two points out of the weekend. Obviously, you look for more than that, but now you just go on to another weekend. And you yeah, I think we got uh, Providence is going to be a really nice test uh, next week again. Uh, we had a good little game with them last night. Um, I think tonight is going to go strides, but that's the effort that we need to bring every night. And if we do that, the rest of the season will go well, and we'll, we'll start winning some games. Um, or we'll win some more games and hopefully finish up top. Is the effort tonight more, more so than you said in the game this half, maybe? Uh, yeah, I think we played, compared to last night, our start tonight was awesome. Um, I think we played a great second period and a great third. Um, just Their goalie played awesome, and but our effort was there, and I think I think uh, even Coach is happy with that. Or nobody's happy with the result, but when you, you gave it your all, and we can say that we played a full 60-minute game, then it's something positive to take home. Tonight, and you guys lost, and you did last night, and you guys won. So. Um, I'd, say, I'd say he was. Um, you know, it's our expectation as a team to come out every night and, and play as hard as we can, and I think tonight we did that. Um, obviously, any time you don't win, it stings, especially when, when you play as well as we did tonight. I think that's the best we've played in a while. Mm -hmm. But, um, you know, it, it's in the past now. It's motivation, and if we play like that every night, I don't think we're going to lose too many games. So um, it's a good motivating factor. I would say that, yeah, as a team, you know, we're never happier with the loss than we are with the win, but... Um, you can, we can get positives from, from the way we played tonight. Well, yourself, yeah, you had several chances and stuff. And it's good to get on the scoreboard, I mm -hmm. imagine, and good to get one in. Did. Yeah, um, absolutely. It felt nice to get that my first goal off, the, off my back. But, um, you know, that doesn't take away from from the negative feelings we get from losing. But um, it was definitely nice to, to start to get some chemistry and um, be around the net. And, generate chances and, and what about the goal itself on. to describe that um power play uh i was in front of the net and shot um from the side deflected behind the net to boris and who did a great job born in battle and got the puck out front to me all i had to do is touch it into an empty net so it's as good as you felt since you've been back you seem to have a little yeah. type of stride yeah tonight. no absolutely um you know obviously the first half for me didn't go as planned but you know, um no, that's, that's no excuse for not producing, and uh, I felt better. Yeah, I'd say absolutely I felt better tonight than I have um, so far this year. Sure. Really. Right, do you feel 100% yet? Or? I think no, I am. Um, you know, all the weight I lost, I gave back, and um, you know, I'm starting to feel good out on the ice, both mentally and physically. So That's nice. Yeah, that. absolutely. It's really <laughs> forward. Definitely. But yeah, I, I feel like I'm 100%. How would you assess the, the weekend as a whole? Um, you know, last night we came out slow, um, really slow, top to bottom. I think we were we were out chance. We they jumped out to a two nothing lead, but we rebounded. So that was positive um, to finish the game strong. But we can't start games the way that we did mm -hmm. um, tonight. I think really for 60 minutes with a, with a few letdowns. Um, 
you know, we played another good game, a good game top to bottom. So, you know, a split, uh, you know, it kind of leaves a bitter taste in your mouth, but um, I think we can build off this weekend, mm -hmm. absolutely.